you're lucky I didn't run over you. <laughs> What's that? A statement? You're trying to make up for that? Oh, you're one of them. Hang on a second, mate. Let me, let me put the handbrake on. I'm coming out. You cut me up on the road, mate. You mean what's my point? What's your point? You cut me off and I nearly ran over you, that's my point. Nearly ran over you? Yeah. Did you not see the tank? You didn't see the tank? I didn't see the tank, mate. So you just stopped in front of me, you didn't see it? To be fair, I stalled the car, man. So I was more focused on what You stalled the car? Yes, I stalled the car. So you got in it, wait a minute, wait a minute. What's this camera doing? This is my videographer, mate. Yeah, I don't want to be on camera, mate. Well, tough crap. If you're going to act like that, you're going to get, you're going to go on camera. Act like what? I cut you up, mate. You cut me off, and you, you're not acknowledging it. You're just being pig-headed. You're not bothered. You're not going to apologise. For what? For cutting me off. No. Are you going to apologise for blocking me in this parking space? I'm not blocking you in. You can drive off at any point. Who do you think you are driving around in this? What do you mean? Who do you think you are driving around in this? It's winter, mate. Winter. It's winter, why have you got the top down? It's December. Mate, obviously, it's a statement vehicle similar to yours. Statement vehicle? Yeah. Bro, like, can you just apologise for what you just did and I'll be on my way? Apologise be... for what? Bro, get your camera no. out of my Jamie, face. No, don't, Jamie, don't threaten him. Get out of my face. Stay where you are. Hang about, mate. Have I given consent for you to film me? Don't need it. What do you mean you don't need This is going on YouTube. Well, you also don't need an apology neither, do you? Yeah, I do. For what? For driving like an absolute idiot. Why are you driving like an idiot? Well, you stalled your car, I nearly crashed into you, nearly ran over you, nearly killed you, and you're just whatever. Well, well done you for not killing me, man. You're welcome. And you're parked and disabled, and you can't even park in between the lines. Again, are you some form of authority? Are you like the police or are you a parking attendant? Because no, nothing. That Mickey Mouse jumper says a beast on it, ain't you ready up? Yeah. You right. know, so you know where I am? Yeah, fully, fully aware of who you are, mate. You know that this is going to go on YouTube then? Like I've already told you, I ain't giving you no consent for none of that, mate. So get your camera. I told you, cameraman. Get your cameraman Jamie, out of my face, You touch him. Get gone. Touch get him right. and we have big problems. Such as? Work it out. Work it out. Sorry. All I want is you for apologise for what you just did and I'll be on my way, mate. I don't really care that you parked in Disabled Bay, but on that, you don't look disabled. I know hidden disabilities and all that, and obviously you are mentally disabled because of what you just done. <laughs> but have you got a blue That's badge? A funny have thing. you got a blue badge? <laughs> Coming from you, look at the big nice hat and the bloody Christmas jumper you got on, brother. And you're saying I'm mentally disabled. Who comes out and dress like that? Hey, it's the middle of winter, you're driving a convertible, you've got a pink, cap, a, team, a pink jacket, Mate, it's is that your missus? Is that your missus' no, jacket? Don't fit her, mate. Why are you getting personal, are you? Well, you're getting a bit personal taking the mick out of my clothing. <coughs> I ain't getting personal at all, mate. You're questioning somebody who's parking in a disabled way when you're fully aware that not all disabilities are visible. Fine. What? But where's your disabled badge? Again, are you the police? No, I'm not. But so, what, mate, what, what reason do I have to show you? It's just etiquette, mate. If you're in a disabled spot, you should put a disabled badge in. So people know. Because that doesn't look like a disabled driver. Am I still attending my vehicle right now? Say that again? Am I still standing right next to my vehicle yeah, right now? you are. Fair so enough. why exactly do I need to put my disabled badge in there? Because you're parked in the disabled spot and you're obviously about to go into the gym. Right then, but you don't know that it could be down the side of the door there and I could be entering it and putting it in the front in a minute. Well, go on then. I'll wait here till you've done it. you wait here till you've done it? Yeah. Honestly. So, I'm going to go to the gym. How long are you going to be here for? Or how long are you going to wait for? Well, I'm doing a workout, so I can be here all day, but I'll make sure you're towed away. You're feeling good, Am I what? You're feeling all right. I'm feeling fine, mate. Yeah, likewise, brother. I pre worked that up to the max, and we'd like to have the workout. Thank you very much. But seriously, mate, just put your blue badge in, and we'll call it a day. So, I'll first, it was an apology, now it's a blue badge. What one is it? Yeah, mate, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it's all good. Yeah. All under control. Because if I don't, you just seem like wasting my time. Like, right, just put your blue badge in, and I'll leave you alone. Simple as that. <coughs> you ready, manners? Please, put the blue badge in, and I'll leave you alone. Right. Do it when I get back. When you get back.
when you get back. When I get back. Are you going to at least park your par car in between the lines? Honestly, that is just... Uh, I just can't fathom that. That is just ridiculous. So, not only did he cut me up on the roundabout, yeah, yeah. he's also parked in a disabled spot. And look how he's parked it. Yeah, that's horrendous. He hasn't even tried. Middle of the winter, roof's down. He's dressed, let's face it, he's dressed like an absolute tit. And he's just told me to go myself. Okay. I'm going to teach this mother a lesson. Are you ready for this, Jamie? What are you thinking, man? I'm going to run over this <laughs> car. <laughs> oh, no. him. The way he's just spoke to me, and like the obnoxiousness, he thinks it's okay to park in a disabled spot. I'm going to teach this guy a lesson. <laughs>